Hello guys, welcome back to the Fat Cat Caravan. How are you all doing alright? Yeah? Good. Right, so I just thought I'd do a super quick video, right, explaining uh, train life's passengers and postage for that matter as well. Um, I've had a comment about this and I must admit, first time I played this game, it was very confusing to me as well. Um, it's not exactly clear, but once you kind of think, oh yeah, you, you work out, oh my God, how can I be so silly? But it's cool. Um, I did the same mistake and I'm sure many people will do the same mistake. Uh, right, so we're talking about passengers today. Now, the question was, I believe, how do I pick up passengers? How does the whole thing work? Well, let me just show you now. Right, so here we are in St. Quentin, Maine. Uh, so, St. Quentin Warehouse, I believe. Yeah, we're in, yes, we are, yeah, cool. So, right, passengers. Now, you obviously got to set yourself up for passengers first. If you don't know how to do this, I'll just quickly run through. I'm sure you do, though, but I just thought I'd run through it just in case. Um, right, go to any service center. It doesn't matter where it is, anywhere. Right, once you get in here, um, the service centers are all everywhere. Every single stop, there's a service center. So don't worry about that, right? They're everywhere. And if you wonder what they look like, if you just, hold on one second, we'll just go back and I'll show you on the map. Just just real, ba we'll go back to basics, all right? I'm sure you know this already, but just in case people don't. Um, so I'm in St. Quentin Warehouse at the moment. Yeah, so if we zoom right in. Oh, sorry, this, the thing about I hate about this map, down is up and up is down. And, and hold on one second, let's just do that again. <laughs> right, okay, slowly. All right, if we zoom in. Okay, we can kind of see the like little um. There you go, the little icon. There you go. It's like the little icon there with the uh, kind of garage and the, the train and the spanner, basically icon. You can see where I am. So, yeah, every station's got one. Just back into there. Right. The next thing you do is right. So on this, uh, you probably set up a cargo, maybe most likely. So what you do is uh, use an L1, R1, or right, right button, left button on Xbox, or whatever. Um, just scroll across to this mode, game mode, right? So you've got two choices: that cargo, passenger, and postage. Passenger and postage are the same, essentially the same thing. So don't worry, that's all good. Uh, so also you want to select that, and then once you select that, we can then go and add wagons. So you could have like, I don't know, free passenger and. Just add them in, like free postage or something, for example. Yeah, so uh, it's just as easy as that. Oh, let's just get rid of those. I don't need postage right now. Yeah, so that's it. And then you're set to go. And then basically you want to spin yourself around. So use an R1 again, right? Or right shoulder one. Right at the end, reverse train. Um, currently, I am not. don't need to reverse, so I'll just back out of that. And make sure you're facing this kind of way, yeah? Cool. Right, that's the first simple shit out of the way. That's how you get into passenger mode, right? As you can see, I've got three passenger cars there. Right, the next step will be to open up the map. Now, this is where it, it, it's not very clear. I mean, obviously, someone's suffered the same fate as me as well. So uh, here we go then. So apologize if I don't remember the, 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 uh, the name of the comment. I, yeah, it, <laughs> I haven't got my um, messages with me, but I'll just thought I'd quickly do this. So yeah, so St. Saint, Saint Quentin, Maine, right? If we press square on that, the square button, and that would be like X on Xbox. Uh, we can see passengers galore. There we go. All different destinations. Now, right, these are the passengers at this station, St. Quentin, Maine. These are the these these are the the routes people want to go to. So if we sort by distance, pressing down on the D-pad, we can sort this to the closest station distance. There we go. The closest distance to us. So the closest one is Paris. And then Reims, Reims, I don't know how to pronounce that, sorry. Calais, and then, right, we can see now at St. Quentin, Maine, we've got 26 passengers wanting to go to Paris. We've got 35 passengers wanting to go to Reims, and so on, yeah? One passenger, yeah, blah, 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 right? So what we do now, let's say, for example, you're trying to level up, I don't know, uh, let's say you're trying to level up a particular city, like, I don't know, Paris. Say you're trying to do Paris, trying to level up Paris, because we, you want passengers, like, on the level up requirements, it says passengers in here, yeah, for example. Um, what you do then, you create a route, so you can go where you want and, and as many stops as you want. I think the um, the drivers kind of do like three stops, depending on how how well they're leveled up. Anyway, you you just create a route. So this for this instance, I'm going to just do a closest one. So I'm going to do a route from St Quentin, Maine. All right, we we'll do one from there. So hit that as your first GPS marker. Remember all main stations, like Ruin Main, St Quentin, Maine, Lily Main, and all that. Right, they're all all the main stations produce passengers and accept passengers. All right. And, and the same thing goes for warehouse as in postage. Warehouse produce postage and they accept postage as well. So this will be the same principle I'm showing you now for passengers for postage. All right, so we want to set a GPS to St. Quentin, Maine. Then we want to, um, we're going to go to Reims, Maine, right? So the next waypoint will be Reims, Maine. Right, now remember, 
let's say, for example, I'm at St. Quentin, Maine. If I'm there already, I'm not at the moment, but if I am there already, then you've got to you've got to include the station you're at because if we press square on the station we're at or the station we're going to our, our first port of call you've got to make that a waypoint as well otherwise this won't work yeah so if we look now go by distance there we go look at that straight away you can see because we're going to reams it's on our it's on our journey it's on our stops straight away ready to pick up 35 passengers to reams you see that because it's on our route and again if we set another waypoint for i don't know paris Right. Let's just say, for example, just sods law was at another one for Paris. If we go back now and check St. Quentin, Maine, right? We've got now got two. Let's have a look. There we go. We've got Paris and Reims because that's the route you're creating. So that there's two stops on the route. You get me? So that's that's what. And also, by the way, when you get to these places, when you get to Reims, there might be passengers wanting to go to Paris as well. So they will jump on board your train when you get to your second stop, for example. Uh, if we sort this by distance, there we go. So there's more, there's more passengers from here to, do you know what I mean, and so on. So that's what we're going to do, but I'm not going to do that. F um, that's how passengers work in a nutshell. Um, that's pretty much it. So again, as you're approaching the station, always remember to um, uh, change with a touchpad, uh, change your um, radio ahead. Uh, so your radio heads in Quentin, Maine, and change your, um, oh, what do you call it, your touch, press the touchpad by changing your, to the pickup point and drop off point, you know, passenger pickup and drop off point. So, um, yeah, just remember to do that ahead. So radio head, get clearance, and then press the touchpad to switch to, um, yeah, the passenger pickup point, yeah? So make sure you get you, you're, it's guiding you to the right place to, to drop off these passengers in there. So, yeah, cool. Um, like, again, it's just a super quick video. I hope that explains it. Um, if it doesn't, just drop me a comment again, and I'll uh, I'll uh, I'll go for it again. It's not a problem, you know. I just had to do this on video because it's it's really hard for me to like add, explain in a comment. It's just like long-winded, do you know what I mean? So I just thought I'd do it like this as a video, and then that way you guys can see that's how you do it. And postage will be the same deal. Uh, you add postage wagons to your setup. You can do mix. You can do both if you want. You can stop off at a warehouse, and then the main, and then you can do it. You can do you can do it's fine. Um, yeah. So warehouse works the same. So if we look at the warehouse. We've got postage deliveries. There we go. Look, there's all the postage deliveries. But just bear in mind, all it is, there's, because I was confused. What I was doing, what I'm sure many people are doing, is pressing square as you do, like, like you do the Iron Mine, press square. There you go. Look, we've got pickups we can do. We can actually reserve those as well, can't we? We can press square to reserve those. I can't currently show you that because I've got the passenger set up. But yeah, do you know what I mean? You can press that and then just drive down and pick it up. That's what I was doing with the passengers. I was getting so wrong. So that's how you do it. So. Yeah, that's basically it, guys. You create the route where you want to go, and then along the way, you'll pick up people. Do you know what I mean? So if your end goal, like I say, is to level up Paris, then just set a waypoint for Paris. And then along the way, people, you might get people from here, like from Reims, Maine, who want to go to Paris as well. So not only are you picking up the ones from St. Quentin, Maine, you're picking up the ones from there as well. So they all go. So that way, you level up Paris, Paris quicker. Do you know what I mean? So, um, yeah, that's how you do that, guys. All right. So, um, yeah, cool. I hope this helps. This video helps. If it doesn't, again, just leave me a comment and I'll uh, I'll try and do my best to, you know, go for it again for you. It's not a problem, man. All right, guys. So, yeah, just again, just a super quick video of how passengers and postage work. They work both the same way. But, yeah, cool. All right, guys. So, um, yeah, peace out. And um, thank you for all your support and your love and awesome. And uh, I'll see you later. PlayStation.